Stable Lives to me is more than a place, it's the people here and they make you feel different about yourself and they challenge your way of thinking. What our team of volunteers try to do is create a really calm, relaxed environment that people that are suffering from the effects of post-traumatic stress disorder can come just to rest and relax and to re-engage into um, basically normal life. PTSD stands for post-traumatic stress disorder. It's um, when the person has induced trauma in bad situations, like maybe it's been war, gunshots, stuff like that, that can mess with the brain. I can be quite good one day, uh, happy-go-lucky, and then the next day I can be throwing alcohol down myself just to try and keep away from what the, the fight that's in my head. Um, I became very detached from my family. Unfortunately, I ended up trying to take my own life because I thought the world would be better off without me because I was causing too many problems. So somebody dealing with the effects of post-traumatic stress disorder, we try to help them in creating a relaxed environment that people can just start to come and spend some time. Sometimes it's just as simple as coming and having a cup of coffee, a biscuit and having a chat. There's no pressure here. You know, there's a garden, they can sit and relax on the bench. When they're ready and when they're happy, they can start to come onto a course, spend a bit more time with us, do some volunteering. It really is down to the individual and where they're at in the stage of recovery. So it's just somewhere that you can come, relax, be yourself, but also when you're in crisis, the door's still open. It's not just a six week course and that's it. At Stable Lives, we find it incredibly important to not only support the individual with post-traumatic stress disorder, but also to acknowledge the impact that it has on their family. Um, we see the pressures that sons, daughters, wives, partners have in helping to support somebody. There might be alcohol, drug abuse, lots of different things, and we think it's incredibly important to support the family as a whole. Stable Lives is a charity that helps like my dad and other veterans that have PTSD and help them get through it. Teddy was a horse that was incredibly nervous, um, very little confidence in himself, but that actually came through as aggression and um, dominance. He hadn't been very well fed, he hadn't been very well managed. So what we had to do was establish a rhythm and a routine in his life where he could start to develop some confidence in humans again. Teddy himself, he's a lovely character. He's, uh, I think he's about six, seven years old. Uh, he's got the biggest tongue in the world, uh, a comical face. When Mike initially came on the course, it was a little bit of a gamble for me to match him with Teddy because it was quite early in Teddy's rehabilitation. But I saw some very similar characteristics in the pair of them and they started to develop um, a relationship that really has proved to be incredibly strong. The horse had to let down his defences in order to trust Mike and Mike had to similarly do the same for Teddy. It was, you know, one of the best feelings in my career to be able to watch the two of them bond and just really start to recover together. I was able to see in Teddy a lot of things that I did, having PTSD, and a lot about the trust issues, and the hypervigilance, the anxiety levels, and it was an awakening for me being able to recognise that in somebody else, because when I used to hide when people were looking for me, I could see them and I'd watch them through the trees, circling around, and that's what we do with the horses, doing the join up, and eventually you go, yeah, I can trust you, and they come over, and Teddy did that with me, and the first day was just, I was blown away. With it. He's, he's just my mate. We spend more family time together and feels like he has a purpose because he can come down here and he's got a job to do. Somewhere to relax, uh, it brings your anxiety levels down, you can chill out uh, and it's a sanctuary. Mm -hmm.